Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Yes, it's the Monday after Thanksgiving, and today we're moving on past the turkey and all of the trimmings. But Chef Cam here is going to show us some delicious, delicious recipes on what to do with the leftovers. Yeah, so yes, so I missed Thanksgiving with you, but you did. I wanted to just let you know and all the other ladies at Sister Circle that yes. I am so thankful that you guys have allowed me to live my dreams out in the year of 2018, and I can't be more thankful, and I just have to start it off with saying thank you so much, and I really appreciate it. I love you, Kim. So we're going to get started. What we're yeah, doing is, it's okay, out. what I'm we're doing is, waffle, we're doing drink. So what we're going to do is chicken and waffles, but okay. we're going to do a cranberry waffle because cranberries Ooh. are the number one stoppers for urinary tract infections. Ooh. And in the month of November, this is Urinary Tract Infection Awareness Let's Month. So we want to stop sending those 11 million women to the hospital every year, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead you know, and have me a cranberry right A fresh right cranberry? Now. Tell me how it is. Is it juicy? It's Ooh. not bad. It's not bad. <laughs> It's a little tart. A little tart, but that, that's good. But I love the crunch of it. Good for balance. Mm -hmm. So we're going to start Just us have you take some of this all-purpose flour. Okay. We have some cinnamon. We have a little salt. We have a little sugar. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and just dump all of that dump right Dump it right in. in there. Just a little bit of that, not all of that right there. And then yeah, we have some water right, right here. Good. We already have a little bit of mix prepped in there. Okay, sounds that's good. That's perfect right there. Mm -hmm. So grab your whisk. Sure will. And all you're going to do is just mix that right in. Mm -hmm. So what I'm going to do, what makes these waffles fall and what gives them that flair that everybody wants yes. is we're going to add some cranberry sauce. Ooh. So you know you might have a little cranberry sauce, everybody that can't cook, because most of our families can't cook. They just really come. They just it. think they can. And they bring the cranberry mm -hmm. sauce. So you got a little and extra. The, and the BK sodas. And the <laughs> don't come in well, my house my with no the fago. So I don't know oh, about the BK. They bring the fago. BK must be a Memphis thing. <laughs> so we add a little cranberries in there. Okay. And what we're going to do is we're going to spray our waffle iron that's already preheated. Okay, sounds good to me, Cam. Sounds good to you? Mm-hmm. Right there. So what I'm going to have you do is, that should be perfect. You see that consistency? Babe, I am whipping The it consistency up. that you want, you want to make sure that it's nice and soupy. I like but that. But it still has a creamy texture, okay? Okay, sounds so good. So just pour that right in there for me. Sure will. You want to fill it almost all the way. Don't let it get above the rim. I don't want to overflow, though, because I don't want it to kind of spill out on the side. <laughs> so mother so has good. to be very careful here. Perfect. I, I love the... I love of the you attention see, to detail. Of course. It's perfect. So we're just going to sit that and we're going to let that cook for about three minutes. And this is a mini. So this is what you call a mini waffle. It's made by Dash. Okay. I actually found it at the Goodwill for a dollar. You did? Cleaned it up did real you nice. Did find me one? I didn't find you one, but we can well, share we can it. we go next time. I'm going to look for you, okay? Okay, thank so you. So what baby. we're going to do is go right to the mimosa. Mm -hmm. I know that's the part yeah, that I you like. I see you got some fried so, chicken over here, Oh, too, I got now. the fried chicken. So what we did was we repurposed some of that extra fried chicken that we had from Thanksgiving and we just incorporated right into our because yes. we already spent all this money on Thanksgiving. Yeah. We don't need to be going out and spending no more when we got food so. already I at the house. I think it's a budget needs to be in order. A budget needs to be yeah, in order. Yeah, because then you got Christmas, Christmas right around the corner. And That's I need a gift from you, so I need to make, you need well, to make you sure know, the budget is... Well, you know, you got something coming I got something anyway. coming. Okay, mm -hmm. so we're going to move right on to the apple cider mimosa. Ooh, I know you love it, don't you? Know you know I love okay, any so type of mimosa you make. A little bit of mimosa. So we're going to start with, I know you like it, just a little splash of apple cider, fresh apple cider. And then we're going to go into this gold. It's a winter reserve. Okay. Prosecco, I know you love Prosecco. I love Prosecco, it's my favorite. Just give it a little favorite. shake. Just a little bit now, hold And a line. pop, just like that. All right. Ooh, look Ooh, at, honey. Ooh. They very busy over they there. They are busy. You see how it ran over like mm -hmm. that? And then we're going to give you about a half a cup, just okay. like that. Ooh, look at that. And I what like we like to cute. garnish it with is a couple fresh cranberries. Let's go ahead and drop a few in there. Just a few in there, just like that. Mm -hmm. And then what you hit it with is a little dash of that cinnamon Ooh, yes. right over the top. And what it's going to do is it's going to give that nice little earthy fall yes. flavor. So try that and I'm tell me what you think that. about that. I have no problem with trying it. Can you I? don't have a problem mm -hmm. with it? Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I said try it. Not just. <laughs> well, this is how I try it. That's how you try it. How you try it. Well, let me see. I'm in these good old cranberries. Yes. Some of those fresh cranberries. Catch that for me, please. Let me get these fresh cranberries. Okay, Quan said the bubbles are very busy. A little busy. So this one right here is for you. Okay. But I love that you're garnishing also with an apple. So yes, with an apple. So I can get you guys some. Get you. Oh, look at that. Let's take that. Let's take that. Let's take that. I got a plate right here for you, Miss Quan. Mm, yes. I'm gonna take that right out for you. Delicious. You know I like to use my hands when I'm with you. Oh, I okay, like that. Okay, so I'm gonna take a couple. Taking a torch. How they said when they with me, they don't wanna leave. Oh, oh man, hey, hey, they don't tell me. You know, I, I wish I would have found you before I found my boyfriend, man. I know. Oh, 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 oh
this one. No, no, no. I, I got you, Miss Trina. This one right here is for you. That's We're gonna hit that with a little fresh maple syrup right Ooh, over the top. Yeah. And what I like to do is drizzle it over the chicken too, so you oh, can get yes. just get a little bit of that like consistency it right top. Oh, yeah. And you oh, sop yeah. it right on up. Now what's this oh, white cream, Cam? So the white cream is a, a, a store bought cream cheese spread. Okay. And what I, I like to use that That's because what, what it do does. To it? You put it on top of the waffle. I put it on top oh, of the waffle yeah, and on top of the chicken. Because we like, because yes. once we add that, that hot sauce on it, you get that sweet and you get a we little got, bit of that where, spicy. Where is Trina's hot sauce? Trina, we have it in here. Sauce. It's in the back. I thought it was okay. in, it's in, it's the, in the, the bag. bag. Okay. It's in the back. So Sorry about that. You, and we're going to make Trina a fresh one right yeah, now. Yeah, because I like she fresh waffles. Lo she loves the hot fresh waffles. I got to taste it. And you can try your mimosa. Did you have your mimosa? Yes, I'll try this while we wait. Well, I'm going to go ahead and take a bite. But before I do that, I'm going to tell you thank you so much for joining us here at the circle. Yes, And for this amazing brunch recipe guys you got to check him out on chef cam uh, and also visit him on instagram